following certain protocols when using a tire balancer can prevent or fix most vibrations. We've got some tips next. A vibration in the steering wheel, a shaking in the driver's seat, or a pulsation in the brake pedal. No, the car isn't haunted. Well, I don't know the background of the car, so maybe it is, but more likely, there are customer complaints that often point to a common problem, tire vibration. According to Coates, around 60% of vibration-related comebacks are due to improper wheel mounting or balancing, but you can minimize vibration comebacks with the proper balancing of your customer's tires. If the technician is experiencing a static mounting error on the balancer, it could be a result of nicked up cones or collets, a worn spring or shaft, or improper clamping. Today, many alloy wheels don't have a simple tapered center anymore. In addition to the mating surface of the hub bore center, a wheel may have a narrow cosmetic front. With several different taper angles being used, it is critical that the cone or collet supports the wheel on the structural taper for accurate balancing. Incorrect contact can allow the wheel to move while on the balancer, leading to false readings and leaving a technician chasing weights, or adding more weight because the balancer asks for more, usually in different places. Before you secure the wheel onto the balancer, perform a spin check and review your readings. If the balancer is not calling for the same weight amount in the same locations, the wheel was not centered on the first or second spin. Double check your mount for repeatability. Your goal is to get your imbalance readings as close to zero as possible before adding weight. The ongoing pursuit of increased fuel economy will continue to increase vehicle sensitivity to vibration and drive the need for tighter balancing tolerances in aftermarket wheel service. Be sure to identify any vehicle that has a sensitivity issue when you come across one and make sure it's noted on the repair order. I'm David Sickles coming to you from the Tire Review Continental Tire Studio at Babcox Media. Thanks for watching.